Hello guys, Adagio here. More recently, I've been thinking about what's the fastest way of encoding video to H.264 format on machine with specified system configuration. Unfortunately, I couldn't find any straight answer to my question, so I decided to test it by myself. If you're interested in my test result, stay a while and watch. I ran this test on my Mac Pro 3.1. It's an early 2008 model and it's equipped with two 2.8 GHz Intel Xeon Harpertown CPUs, 12 GB of RAM and ATI Radeon HD 5770 graphic card. The operation system is OS X 10.9.5. I think these are the most significant parameters of my machine relevant to this test. At first I prepared two video files one minute long each. The first one is a standard definition DV file with interlace and the second one is a HD ProRes HQ file with interlace as well. I encoded these files with four encoders I'm familiar with. MPEG Stream Clip, Apple Compressor 3, Apple Compressor 4 and Adobe Media Encoder CC 2014. The output format is as I said before H264. The other parameters of encoding I set according to the source format. Limit data rate was 5 megabits per second for SD and 8 megabits per second for HD. Frame size was unscaled, so with 720 by 576 for SD and 1920 by 1080 for HD and 25 frames per second just like in the source material. I turned on the interlace option for both tasks. The sound output format is MPEG4 AAC, stereo 48 kHz and 256 kilobits per second, but I think it's not crucial in this competition. Ok, the settings are done, so let's begin the test. SD video encoding first. Ready, steady, go! The fastest encoder in this case was Apple Compressor 4, which encoded 1 minute of SD video in 28 seconds. Now let's check the encoding of HD video. Ready, steady, go! And we've got a winner! It's also Apple Compressor 4, which encoded 1 minute of HD video in less than 1 minute and 38 seconds. The slowest was Apple Compressor 3. It encoded the same video file in 2 minutes and 38 seconds, so the difference is 1 minute. Someone could say, hey, it's only 1 minute. But remember that I encoded 1 minute long files. If you encode 60 minutes video, the encoding will take 60 minutes more, and this is a lot of time. So that's it. I hope this video will help you in making decision which application choose for H.264 encoding. Thanks for watching. If you like my videos, please subscribe to my channel and see you later.